you're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. So, what did you get? Lot of stuff. Well, not quite. We got some stuff, not a ton. Half of it's probably expired. There just wasn't a lot left. This it? Yeah, well, we've been picking Macon clean for weeks. <sighs> Fuck. Which is why I've been saying, and I don't want to sound like a broken record here, but we gotta hit the road. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. So, you two are, uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily's concerns are valid, you know. Of course you think they God are. God damn it, I'm not on anyone's side, Kenny. This is about everyone. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? <coughs> Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. We got plenty of food from that station wagon. We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. It's fucking stupid. But look, we've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Uh, rough day, I guess. Yeah, but I've just been calling them days lately. I don't know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now... If she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. Hmm. Yeah. Ja, was sollen wir jetzt machen? Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. Here I'm sorry. Going. How are you, Lee? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah. We can't turn on each other any more than we have. A 
about the guns. Don't you start. Uh, nee, jetzt bei Staffel uh, I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably drei. good nee. they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. But we need them. There's no doubt about that. Muss ich mit Lee ins Zeug legen, ja. Hm. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. <clears throat> so what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I'll talk to you later. Good. Ich habe nur das Gefühl, ihr passt es eigentlich einfach nicht. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Hey, Doug. Hi. Enttäusch dich. Was machst du? Fühlst du dich hier sicher? Was hältst du von Lily? Das würde mich mal interessieren. Fragen jetzt mal das hier. What do you think about Lily? Dark. I don't know. I guess I'm sad. Nobody deserves to lose their parent like that. You don't think that would make her delusional, do you? I think it could make you anything. Nothing good. Hmm, nächste Frage. Was machst du? Fühlst du dich hier sicher? Do you feel safe here? Hmm. Safety has always been a bit of an elusive thing for me. I mean at the motel, as opposed to finding somewhere new. I think if we can get whoever is out there to leave us alone, this is a good place to be. And you know, they sort of stopped attacking. Maybe they forgot about us. Okay. I'll catch you later, Doug. Uh, um... Zum Beispiel schnack mal mit ihm hier. Hey Ben. What's up, Lee? Findest du, dass du, äh, dass du die nicht äh, bist? Was was du öfters im Mail kann? Was hältst du von Lee? Ich mach mal dazu fragen. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Pang jetzt auch mal. Did you ever come down here to Macon much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh, I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is. Findest du das? Ja, das hatten wir glaube ich schon. Aber ich frisch lag. You feel useful to the group? What? Useful? Yeah, how's your spirits? I'm fine. I'm helping, right? For sure, Ben. Mm. Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. Gut, äh, mit den einen haben wir schon geschnackt. Wo ist Clementine denn? Ähm, Clementine? Äh, wo ist denn Clementine? Hallo? I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I think you're coming on here. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I just... I feel like a crazy person. Can I do anything for you? Yes. I need help. There's a traitor. Somebody. One of us. Out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. 
Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. Okay. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. Your ward. <laughs> That's Robin. I know who it is. You can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. <laughs> hmm. Good. That would help. Yeah. Can I go here? No, we can't. Ah, wo ist Clementine? Hallo? Ah, da ist sie da. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <lacht> Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that what do you think dog? about Doug? He's cool. Cool? He knows things. You don't think he seems down? Like sad? Yeah. Everyone is. You? I'm okay. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. <laughs> See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you too. <sighs> Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Hmm. <lacht> ja. A flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. Hey, Doug. Hiya. Do you know anything about this flashlight? Well, I can tell Ooh, you... Wait, 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 wait. I know you know everything about this flashlight. I'm asking if you know how it got busted. Lily found it in the dumpster. Oh, no. No, I don't. I'll keep my eye out for some suitable parts, though. <laughs> That'll give me something useful to do. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? 
Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Hi, guys. Hi, Lee. Hmm. Hey. Find anything? I'm worried that we're losing Doc. Where's he going? I mean, he feels worthless. And if that turns to helpless, then we could have another body on our hands. I'm not a therapist. Me neither. Are you worried about morale at all? The darker things get, the more we have to worry about people giving up. Tell me about it. I know you won't. I'm worried, but what can we do? I don't know. I haven't found out anything Well, there's yet. nothing to find in here. Ask around. Jesus, investigate. Okay, okay. Do you ever want to leave here? I want to leave here when we have to, not because of some fantasy of somewhere better. So, you think the coast is a pipe dream? Don't you? We're going to live on the water because we assume they can't swim? We're alive because we've stayed here. That's as far as the discussion needs to go. I'll be back. Mm hmm. 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 Some broken glass uh, on the yeah. ground there. Hmm. There's something drawn there. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Dark. A clue! Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. <laughs> Hey, Doug. Hiya. Do you have any uh, chalk I can borrow? No. Don't the kids have some? You know, a piece of charcoal is a suitable alternative depending on your marking surface. Since we're on the subject, did you know that while chalk is traditionally known to be calcium carbonate, what's often used in classrooms is actually made of gypsum thanks to favorable domestic mining conditions? Doug, I did not know that. Happy to be of service. Hey, Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... well, my thoughts, and I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. Hmm... Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. I'll talk to her.
Mann, ich wollte nur zu Clementine hin. Hallo? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues and... Yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. Cool. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, Got our people out there! Out here. We ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life! Shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. We have more supplies. We can keep the deal going. Too late, shithead! We ain't giving second chances. It, it was a mix-up. We'll make it worth your while. I'm listening. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. And shut up, bro! Christ! Oh, shit! No, no. Get over here! 
over here! Hurry! Man, you saved our asses. Get inside! Katja, hang on! Where is she? She's right behind that van. Get your asses around behind. Nein! Get down here! 